before the primary elections, candidates are out campaigning the old-fashioned way. Curtis Hertel Jr. has knocked on almost 30,000 doors in the past few months. In this day and age when we have so many choices out there in terms of electronic media and everything else, the most important thing you can do is actually talk to someone, look them in the eye, shake their hand and ask for their vote. But it's not just to get support, it's to get voters to actually cast a vote. Many people don't realize that about 80% of the local elections will be decided tomorrow. Since there are no primary elections for the governor or Senate races this year, analysts like Tom Shields say that that might discourage people from going out. There's no candidates statewide that are driving out the voters, so then it's all down to the local elections. Local elections that get even less attention without big names on the ticket, and that makes a local candidate's job even harder. Thank you. Michigan Republicans and Democrats don't have any big initiatives in the primaries, so it's up to individual candidates to encourage people to go out and vote. The candidates are out on both sides, um, Democrats and Republicans vying to hopefully win the primary and get their message out. Littell says the most important thing to remember is to cast your vote. And that's what we're really focused on is making sure that folks know tomorrow is going to be the primary election and that they're out there exercising the right to vote and making sure their voice is heard. And candidates like Hertel hope hitting the campaign trail will bring up that voter turnout. In Lansing, Nicole Chadwick, Fox 47 News.